Hello and welcome back to another episode of Phoenix Point. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing the beloved uh, blind legendary run. I'm trying to do my best in the game on the hardest difficulty and we're going to see how well this is going to turn out as Kuara, a haven is under attack. We need to fight against uh, attacking strength six, six enemies and the defenders have won well that looks pretty bad for the defenders i would say but we come in with a fresh set of forces we got the tiamat crew little green uh, anders is with us tyler triggerfinger and natalia Ery plus jim hacker vince are all trying to do their best and of course our favorite vehicle birdie is with us still haven't figured out um, how you can get more ammunition yeah anyways all items on the battlefield will automatically be recovered after mission success here we go as for the vehicles I mean I like birdie it's a decent vehicle and I absolutely like the gun, which is incredibly strong, but you then also need to realize that Birdie counts for three soldiers. And that on the other hand, Ready. I would say I would rather take three soldiers instead of dealing with Birdie. Moving to coordinates. Jim moves up. I was born ready. Anders, who's our In melee frontline, takes a move, stays there. Great. Tyler Triggerfinger. I think this is going to be one of those missions where. We're going to have a lot of enemies against us. Okay, some of which come from right the back. Several of which come from the back. Correction. Yeah, not the right engagement range. These guys are pretty far away. Natalia overwatches. We don't have another overwatch for Tyler. And little green takes a bit more of a frontline position here. Full cover. But we're taking a frontline position. Finally, we got our car. I don't want to immediately like go in with the car. Birdie has taken a lot of damage the last time and this time we're using it more as a fire support. Damn it, Overwatch failed. Oh no, we don't want poison worms. Good. This here looks like a perfect, perfect position to test our heavier guns. Up here, on the other hand, it feels like that it's the perfect position to disengage. It could have could have been already a game winning play like that's super strong if they cluster up holy ok 
Okay, let's feed Natalia a couple of kills, shall we? Right, that's one down. Ready. I would love to hit his stupid face. We do have how many will willpower? Four. I tell you what, we're just Identify shooting and if we're target. not getting it down, we still have our war cry ability. Doing it. We leave the poison worms up there. Free up some line of sight. Ready to rock. Unfortunately, we haven't killed him in one go. Much better. Leads for 10. But has 50 hit points, so... We gotta deal with that. I'll be right there. No. Let's try that again. Wait until he's up. And not again. Not good. Good, which leads us to Natalia here. Has enough will points to take one more shot from a good position. I can make a difference. Ready for action. All I need is a clear shot. Equipment damage. Well, that doesn't help us, does it? Covering. Overwatch. That's the one defender, disciples of Anu. Cleansing some Seems to be having a shotgun. I like it. Quite a few poison worms. We gotta deal with those. The exalted walks with me. Come on. No, yet another miss. Well that was a fail, my friend, because guess what? Birdie is immune. Very nice. Very nice. Straight into the ass. That's our move. 
preparing to fire. He bleeds for 70 and has 50 hit points, so... Let's go. He's not going to survive. A little bit of damage, not bad. Now it's time to deal with the worms. Easy peasy. Where's the third worm? This thing always throws three, right? Proceeding. Look, don't tell me. We've missed the last worm. I've got to be quick. Zooming in. Good. Just getting some will points on her back. She will need a next turn. Birdie provides cover. And there were still a few worms in that direction. For a new. Yes, nice. The shotgun. Keep on going. Shoot again. So the idea here is to just overload us with stupid stuff. Ready to roll. Moving over. Let's, Let's see. Free them. aim. That ready to just a warning shot. That's one down. Looking for an angle. Acquiring One. targets. Two. Three. Let me see. Moving up, and we need another free shot. Missed. You miss? Oh my gosh. We have more willpower? Yes, we do. <laughs> Out of ammunition? Oh no. Oh. The irony. In my sights. out of ammunition as well can we just drive over them no apparently not apparently they are just too tough hoping Natalia could also get into 
get into that uh, vehicle. Fortunately, that's not the case. And we're likely going to Here. see some damage on her now. That's really unfortunate. To fire. <clears throat> Bleeds for 40. <sighs> Maybe that will prevent it, but I'm honestly doubtful. Holding position. I like those infection weapons. I would like to get more of them. The past die for the <laughs> Okay, so a couple of things here. Let's blast them. One down. Easy Two down. Peasy. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Let's blast them. Jim tries to deal damage. This guy is now bleeding for 60. I'm on the move. Attempting to acquire target. <clears throat> Little green. Free aim and go. One hit. Look, he's bleeding for 60, but not yet dead. We still have, well, it's the last two ammunition. I think that's okay, because I think that's also the last enemy. Semi last, yeah, there was one more here. You have been watched. We will feed you I wonder what kind of enemy is in there because they have been going back and forth with it since ages now. Let's see now. Oh, it's one of those like melee things that we've been warned about. Okay, cool. Ready it is. Plan. Looks Good. dangerous. Move up. Get in. Yes. Move up. Get in. 
and that way we can. I was born ready. Transport everyone a little bit faster onto the other side. To have a priest as well. Oh, now that thing is mind controlled. Cool. I want to have a priest. How do I get one? Disciples of a new priest. That's the type of uh, character that I want. Berserker? Yeah, fine. But where are the mages in this game? The ones uh, where I can wreak havoc and cast a couple of spells. What kind of soldier do we have here? Disciples of a new priest fighters are created through advanced mutations and chemi chemical stimulation. Well, they don't have a recruit here. There's a berserker. Here's another recruit. Another berserker. Oh, they just built advanced training facilities. Okay, cool. Understand. Hmm. We got two berserkers. Good, for now I think we're fine down here. What we wanted to do is get back to Phoenix Point and then do this mission here. Against the mist. Friendly, friendly, friendly. What we're doing now, uh, pretty good. I thought initially would be only possible to do like two of the factions appear to be one of those games but i was wrong moving here and then moving back construction complete okay so we got the research labs here now And an AI-controlled facility for all research projects. Are we seeing research? Oh yeah, it picks up. It's much faster. It was 13 hours. Now it's 9. I like it. So let's build... We already got living quarters here, right? Yeah, we do. Let's make this here our research facility and three should be fine i mean where we do not need to go go overboard with it still leaving a little bit room for whatever else is needed and i would like to get more materials as uh, i still want to use our soldiers uh, 
mutate our soldiers. Okay, so we'll take that. It's a valuable trade for us. Yeah, it's still okay, but I need the resource at the moment. Good, we're going back to base in a second, Research just complete. to fill up. Snyderian aircraft, we got the Helios. Okay, that's cool. I haven't been thinking about building more. Tech and materials, okay. Which means, I wonder, uh, do we have enough tech to modify grill? Augment. Hmm. I think the answer is yes. So, we do have one juggernaut torso. And that's all good. But that melee improvement that is actually quite good Com uh, combined with dash i think uh, we're on to something and then the serious extra extra speed does not trigger overwatch which is also good the other alternative is speed lower absorbs shock I like the mind uh, immunity to mind control. This is super good. I'm wondering potentially we're going with Vengeance Torso and Clarity Head. Augment. And that mind control immunity, super good. Shuts us out uh, of the other options, but Grell now looks brutal. So do we want the axe for 140 or do we want the hammer? Axe is 140 and 50 bleed. Hammer is 160. It's one hand to use. Weight a little bit higher. That's 190 and this is... It's more upfront uh, damage but no bleed, right? Well, this is together with a bleed almost 200. The shock, I think, is stun that we're seeing. Hmm, it's a good question. Let's test that hammer for a while and see how we like it. And Andrew takes uh, the axe for now. We got that helmet uh, going for us. Yeah, potentially that new armor isn't bad either. I like the whole accuracy thing, but armor I noticed is also important. And the accuracy one I would only give more to the backline units, so Euler should actually have that suit here. Because it will make him more accurate. 
of all accuracy now plus 11 that's good yeah that makes sense so our backline Euler will be one of the backline fighters you just don't have the sniper yet but basically he and Dilly would be the ones uh, going a little bit further back so that's the back line Grell would definitely be front line uh, I need movement 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 for her the immunity to mind control is just huge we're a bit encumbered here <sighs> Good. Better. That solved uh, the encumbrance. Yeah, Jarenx would be frontline, Grell would be frontline. And I think we're putting Shattered Realm also as a frontliner. I don't see any disadvantage in augmenting yet, but I've also seen that they said something about evolving and maybe that means uh, gene splicing or whatever you would call it with uh, DNA like the disciples are doing. Okay, move in here, short trade. They're empty, okay. And move in here. So we can now build the Helios, capacity five, range, speed, Oh, it's pretty fast, but only carries five. <clears throat> so that could be something for, say, trading only to fly around and just do all of the trading. I don't know. The new Manticore definitely would be stationed here and we're building up that second station for now. The guys should slowly but surely level up. Can't get a second class for him yet. Definitely want that war uh, washout. Okay. Good personnel. They're all good. And they are not regenerating as fast because they are in a different base. Okay, well, that's not great. Let's move there and we got new entries shield bearer champion okay tyrant alpha a marksman and the siren we already had all of those feels a little bit redundant In 2022, a group of researchers investigating an anthrax outbreak caused by melting permafrost in northern Siberia went missing. The Phoenix Project tried to find out what happened to them, but our resources were stretched too thin, 
and our allies in the Russian government were losing influence, so we let it go. All these years later, looking at these samples, I wonder, is this where it started? Is this the first outbreak? If we had done more, could we have stopped it? The genetic material I have recovered might hold the answers, but I'm not sure I want to know. Our operatives have reached a defunct research station in northern Siberia, identified in Symes notes as a significant point of interest. The doors stand open and there is no sign of life. Signs who worked at the station are all long dead. Their mutated bodies lie frozen in the strange demoniac poses. It's easy from our operatives to retrieve samples where they were searching, which Randolph Symes came all this way to examine. Um, okay. Well, we got one more option down here. Research complete. Gauss technology. Okay, finally, finally, military uh, grade coil guns that use electromagnetism for projectiles. Acceleration had already been development, uh, development well before the Pandora, uh, Pandora virus outbreak. However, under the pressure from rivaling manufacturers, United States military withdrew its support for the project uh, for the prototype Gauss rifle. After founding New Jericho, West brought the technology back and soon became the central part of the New Jericho arsenal. Very good, nice. So, sniper rifle, single shot, good range. High ammo capacity. Machine gun and uh, pistol. What I'm missing is exactly that. The Bulldog, which does have more shred, has only 160 instead of 180, but a higher effective range and good ammunition capacity. This is the weapon that I would want. Manufacturer. Oh yeah, finally. Well, the one thing that we're missing is materials. Cyclops, 130 damage single shot versus 110. A little bit lower effective range, but it's just these weapons are definitely an upgrade. So the next tech goes straight into building that. This is a transmission to the world. The rising tide of salvation has begun. While you all cower in your own filth and deviancy, the pure have started the cleansing wave to rid the world of all impurities. No haven is safe, whatever treacherous leader or hopeless beliefs they follow. You have two choices. Cast off your flesh or have it stripped for you. Okay, well. Ultimate uh, war declaration. We're doing that. This here is still out of reach. Our research is still going. Integrate their bodies with existing neural technology. Well, we're going to do that. And after that, oh, we, yeah, we would need to destroy the one weapon that we do have. Okay, understood. Trade. Um, I tell you what, that's not even a really bad trade. Let's manufacture 200. I would want to have the Bulldogs first, because they would be the biggest upgrade for us right away. Oh. 
research complete. Good, we got a new Jericho aircraft. What does that do? Uh, Thunderbird. Higher capacity, lower speed. Can carry seven people, but is substantially slower. Okay, well. I'm going to build that. And this will be our next mission. I think everyone here is ready. Let's just double check their equipment. Could use some more ammunition just for good measure. Yeah, I think we're fine. Okay, good. That brings us to the end of uh, today's episode. Uh, guys, if you are a uh, fan of shooting first and asking questions later, then shoot that like button first and ask questions later. Take care. Goodbye.